and welcome to another episode of Hooked on OC right here on WMDT TV 47 every Sunday morning at 7 a.m. It's our first show of the 2020 season. 16 years Dave Messick and I have been big bringing this show to you and we're glad to do it for another year. And who better to go fishing with today than my good friend Big Bird Cropper. We're doing some root fishing at the Route 50 Bridge. First up, it's my good buddy David Wells and Dale Timmons, inventor of the Deadly Double. We're gonna be doing some cruising around Route 50 Bridge. I'm gonna drop them off, and then it's Big Bird Cropper and his world famous Roy Rig. Striped bass are here pretty much year round, and nobody knows how to catch them better. Stay tuned after the break. We'll be right back with the first episode of 2020, Hooked on OC. Hooked on OC, we'll be right back. Quiet Storm Surf Shop on the boardwalk has the largest selection of sunglasses on the East Coast. Over 800 pairs of coasters, including their new USA models to choose from. Hundreds of Oakley sunglasses, hats, and t-shirts. An enormous collection of Ray-Ban, Smith, Persol, Canon, Revo, and Maui Jim. Quiet Storm Surf Shop has the largest selection of main brand sunglasses. Visit Quiet Storm today. Call Spencer Yachts and Spencer Yachts Brokerage whether you are looking to build a new Spencer Sportfish or buy or sell a used Spencer or boat by any other builder. Spencer Yachts and Spencer Yachts Brokerage are the right choices for dependable and unbeatable customer service for all your Spencer needs. Building and selling custom outboards, express and Sportfish Yachts from our 26-foot center console to our 90-foot Sport Yacht. Call or email us today to become part of the Spencer family. Sunset Marina is Ocean City's premier full-service marina resort. Sunset Marina is located just five minutes from the Ocean City Beach and Boardwalk. Sunset's charter fleet boasts the finest fleet of sport fishing boats in the Mid-Atlantic, all operated by Coast Guard licensed captains. One look at Sunset's amenities and you're hooked for good. Contact Sunset Marina today to book your fishing charter. Call 1-877-514-FISH. And now back for more Hooked on OC. Yeah. I was gonna lay on the floor and say Nah, there I don't make there's nothing in there. Looks like a point break, man. Surf is up. Work, you know. Just work. <laughs> Bring the old timers, man, and show us up. <laughs> what in the world? <laughs> Talk about a surprise. I don't know if nice big. work, man. I don't think he's big enough. What do you mean big yeah. enough? He's got to be 16, doesn't he? 18. Uh, 18. Was it 18 to 27? That's a little bit of a surprise. 
Tell me about it. Okay. Secret lure. What's he got to be? 18. You're, you're sure of that? Yep. All right, let's let's check. He ain't gonna make it. Time yeah. out. All right, look, we're looking for we're looking for 18 inches. We got set. What'd you say? 17 and a half. Yeah. Yep. Leave it up to old Dale here, man. He's showing us up. First off, decided to pull right into the bridge here because the uh, the casting bite was not going off for us. No rockfish. No specks. Decided to come in here and try to flounder underneath the bridge, and there's a little surprise red drum. There's the uh, there's a little black spot on the tail. Sometimes there's lots of them back here. Most of the time there's only one. Nice work. You're caught. You're catching. You release them. Go ahead. Here we go. Go ahead. Back to it. Thank you, bro. Hooked on OC. We'll be right back. Speed World at Jolly Roger Park on 30th Street, one of America's largest, the area's fastest and baddest go-kart tracks. And now, with the lowest prices in Ocean City, Speed World with 10 tracks and over 500 cars featuring the cyclone of five-story kart coaster, named by Fox News as one of the country's top new amusement attractions. Come to Speed World on 30th Street in Ocean City, fast and furious fun for the entire family. Now, with the lowest prices in Ocean City. At Park Place Jewelers, we believe your true love should be wearing the brightest diamond in the room. Why do seemingly identical diamonds have a 70% difference in price? Park Place Jewelers is introducing the Bright Crystal Diamond, which is scientifically proven to be in the world's top 10% of all the world's brightest natural diamonds. Come into Park Place Jewelers and find out why from virtual reality to third-party validation and a GIA grading report, we will provide more buyer education and instill confidence in our customers that the Bright Crystal Diamond they are buying is a world-class diamond. Did you know you can bring in your prescription to an optical galleria? Did you know an optical galleria has a lab and makes glasses right here in OC? Did you know an optical galleria is an authorized Costa RX dealer? It's simple. An optical galleria can help you see. If you want awesome old school customer service and hot new styles, bring your prescription in to an optical galleria today. The place to see and be seen. Make an optical galleria your destination for eyewear. Atlantic Tackle, we know fishing. Atlantic Tackle is the Mid-Atlantic's most complete tackle store, showcasing a huge selection of rods and reels, bait and tackle, fishing apparel, eyewear, and ocean-inspired home decor from industry leaders like Penn, Shimano, Bait Masters, Costa, Smith Optics, Pelagic, Hook, Olakai, Extra Tough, and Yeti. Stop by Atlantic Tackle on Sunset Avenue across from Sunset Grill in West Ocean City or visit us online at AtlanticTackle.com. And now back for more Hooked on OC. Trout! It's a trout! Look at that! I got him. Got him? Got him? I got something too. Drop on the deck! Drop on the deck! I got a flounder. <laughs> oh, what stupidity we live around. <laughs> Let me get this boat straight. We'll talk to you guys. <laughs> what well, is insane? What happened then, Dale? <laughs> huh? What happened to you then? Nothing. I got a nice bite. Caught a flounder. I don't think it's, <laughs> big. I don't think it's big enough, but you never know. We're gonna try them out. I think that fish is close. Dale's a pessimistic son of a gun. No, no. I use almost use another word, but he would have slapped me. He's 16. Yeah. All right. But his 16-inch flounder is not the top news of the last couple of minutes. Standing by. Let's let this boat go by. Yeah. All right. So here's how here's how this works out. Our plan is we're gonna go up to the thoroughfare area around the thoroughfare where my good buddy Ayrton Pryor from the Spring Mix 2 sent me a couple of speckled trout pictures from the other day. He had five to be exact. Nice fish. Had one fish that was 26 and a half inches. Really, really quality specs. This time of the year we start to see them moving into the bay and they can be really nice fish. Tasty eating fish. So the plan was go up there where he was. Do some casting. 
Well, that's what we did. And if we had a three and a half hour long TV show, you'd have seen all that nonsense because absolutely nothing was caught. So we said, all right, hey, look, let's go try the Route 50 bridge. Some flounder's still around. Never know, we might catch a small rockfish, see if we can salvage something out of this. Well, lo and behold, we get underneath the Route 50 bridge here. Dale catches a red drum at much short. I get a bite, pretty certain it's a flounder. And then David Wells, ooh, I think I got something. Show him what's up, Dave. Yeah! <laughs> That's what we came out here looking for originally. Actually gave up on it, and then uh, lo and behold, he shows his beautiful face once again. But this is a speckled trout. I've never personally caught one, but that's him. That's a really nice speckled trout. They get huge. State record here in Maryland is 13 pounds. Dale told me just a little while ago the world record was held down in Virginia for a little while. That was 16 pounds. And you say a bigger fish got caught out of Florida, right? Fort Pierce, Florida now holds the world record, but that's him, man. Speckled trout. You see those little grabby teeth he's got in the front there? That's for grabbing small prey, minnows, mullet, bunker. And this one ate a, show them that bait. This one ate a jig head with a gulp. The all around bait. Really tasty eating fish. Can't tell by looking at it, but he's, he's real slimy. He's got a protective coating on him just like most fish do. And this one is actually really, really slippery. Big difference between this one and a gray, gray trout is, gray trout's a weak fish. The speckled trout is a spotted sea trout. They eat the same stuff, they hang in the same areas. Those fish get a little bit bigger than this one. And here's the bait Dave caught them on. That's just nothing but a half ounce jig head and that six inch gulp, man. That's that new color we've been telling you about. Great for flounder. Salmon red. Write it down, remember it, put it in your tackle box. We are trying to catch another one. Yeah! Give him a Can I hold that up real quick? Hooked on OC, we'll be right back. a lot of fish here at Hooked on OC and my JPR custom rods are nothing but the best. Some of the finest inshore, offshore, casting, spinning and trolling rods on the planet today. Custom rods, custom logos, all at unbeatable prices. Go to JPRrods.com. Hey guys, what's up? We're here with Luke from Sandmarks Marketing. He's here to tell us all about this awesome guy he's got ready for you to pick up in town. Luke, what's up? Hey Scott, how you doing? Thanks. Luke Howard from Sandmarks Marketing here to introduce the premier edition of uh, Destination Ocean City in the Delaware Beach. You got a great golf guide in here. Of course, you got something for the fishermen. I do. I also have spa, salon, and attractions for the wife and family, too. We're a comprehensive overview of the entire Del Marva area. Pick it up in your hotel room while you're in town. Look for the beach chair and you'll be there. Tipsy Tiki is a floating tiki bar, the only one in the Ocean City area that is Coast Guard certified for 12 passengers with a Maryland State liquor license. Great for bachelor, bachelorette parties, and birthdays, anniversaries. Enjoy a calm cruise in the backwaters behind Assateag Island in Ocean City. The cost is $70 per person, which includes a 90-minute cruise and full bar service. You can bring your own food or you can call Crab Alley for carryout. Check us out at Facebook or our website at tipsytiki.com. Call 443-606-0822. Our friendly crew is ready to welcome you aboard. The cool wet spring and the short summer means an abundance of leftover inventory. So at Arctic Heating and Air Conditioning, when you buy a high efficiency gas furnace and coil, we'll replace your air conditioner for $9.95. We also have great deals on heat pumps, and if you buy a 16 sear system, you get a free 10 year part and labor rapid repair warranty. But this deal won't last long, so act fast. 
Call Arctic Heating and Air Conditioning for your free no-obligation estimate today. For program details, call your local Arctic office or visit them online at arcticheatandair.com. And now back for more Hooked on OC. So, hey guys, welcome back to the show. Thank you for tuning into this episode of Hooked on OC, WMDT TV 47, every Sunday morning at 7 o'clock. I messed up a couple weeks ago and said 7.30. A couple times, I think. Facebook post 7.30. You guys have been missing a half hour show? My bad. But 7 o'clock every Sunday morning, WMDT TV 47. What's up? What up? Maddie! Jamie! <laughs> So glad you guys do cooking segments with me nowadays. So yeah. are we. Especially because you bring <laughs> the food. It's not, just, it's not just the looks, it's the food. It's the food. Yeah. And today we're going to talk about some stuff you guys have going on throughout the off season. Yes, a lot of people sir. don't know you have crabs year round. And you do lunch specials. We do. Pretty much every day of the week. Every day of the week. There's a lunch special every day of the week. Just something special that we do, you know, to take care of the locals yeah. who support us year round. Um, First Monday is a fried fish sandwich. Um, this is a I know that. That's solid flounder. piece of fish. Um, the type of fish varies: flounder, rockfish, um, cod. You never know. Um, you well, can you ask can when you come in, portion. but expect okay. this size portion. Um, typically, yeah. Um, Tuesday. This is actually Thursday. This okay. is our quesadillas, Thursday. seafood stuffed. Um, typically like shrimp and crab meat mixed in there with some cheese, our fresh pico de gallo, and that spicy signature sriracha, Sig Sriracha. Sig Sriracha, love Everybody it. loves, um, with our homemade chips, tortilla chips. We make these in-house Old Bay tortilla chips. I asked you a couple minutes ago, like, they're are these sick. the old generic brown baggers? And no. they're not, you guys make these, cut we them, fry them, fresh them, in-house. Fry, fry them in-house, they're delicious. Yes, sir. Um, Tuesday, Taco Tuesday. Um, these are fish tacos, but we also offer shrimp tacos on Tuesday as well. Also with That's our delicious. fresh chips and pico. That's um, a hunk of fish too in there, by the way. It's a nice sized piece of fish. Our fish tacos are definitely the most popular. They're to die for, so come get it. Um, Friday is Slider Friday. You can get um, crab cake sliders or shrimp salad sliders or mix and match, get one of each. Um, and that's served with coleslaw and a pickle and also just like unbeatable. Yeah. You Customer can't beat this. phase You're right, right you can't here. Beat this. Matter of fact, I'm gonna beat it against the roof of my mouth. Of course. While Parker talks crabs. Okay, guys. So a lot of you don't know, but we do have crabs year-round. Um, after usually around the first of December, they turn over to Louisiana crabs, which are the next best thing you can get to Maryland crabs. Um, so we will have these year-round. They're they're awesome. Um, they're nice and heavy, and they're big crabs. So definitely keep those in mind. Um, even in the off season, yep. because you know we still got them crabs to go. We have to deliver on that. Nothing be um, better than Maryland crabs, but alternative, exactly. they are incredible. If you have the craving, yeah. come and get them. Um, we also carry um, our crab meat year round. What we do in the off season is um, it's still Maryland crab meat. It's flash frozen, um, which is a process where they almost instantly freeze it. By the time you thaw it out slowly, you don't get any of that moisture that you would get. Um, <laughs> You don't get any of that moisture that you would get um, through the regular freezing process. So we have it flash frozen for you guys to pick up um, or we'll have it already thawed out, ready to eat. It's um, it's awesome. And it's like I said, it's still fresh. It's still, you know, Maryland crab meat. It's not pasteurized. It's a lot better than pasteurized. So definitely come and get this as well in the off season. Who knows the phone number and website? 410-641-9379. Crabstogo.com. Uh, yeah! You Come can pick check up us gift out. Gift cards here and on the website as well. Check out the menu like I do every time before I come over. Guys, love you very much. Awesome job Thanks as out. always. Yeah. Folks, we'll be right back after the break for a little bit more work on OC. Can't even talk, so stuff in my face. <laughs> Woo! Sweatshirts. And don't forget crabs to go swag available right inside. We have our new crew necks, our hoodies, um, our regular beanies, and then our pom pom beanies. So come check them out. Crabs yeah. to go. <laughs> Hooked on OC, we'll be right back. 
There's nothing more exciting than a day of offshore sport fishing. The sun, the sea, and a boatload of your friends trying to land the big one. Ocean City Fishing Center is the area's number one charter fleet with 37 boats sailing out every day looking for the big fish. Tuna, marlin, dolphin, and shark. Every crew that sails is dedicated to your excitement. And all our captains are licensed by the U.S. Coast Guard for your safety. Headboats are also available for family fishing fun. Whether your party is big or small, call Ocean City Fishing Center. Tight lines and good times. Hey everybody, looking for what's going on in and around Ocean City? Pick up the dispatch. 25,000 copies in over 200 locations all around Delmarva. And the Fishing OC Fishing Report by yours truly with pictures from Dave Messick and some of the best captains in the biz. Pick it up. Racetrack Marine, the area's premier Tidewater center console and Sylvan pontoon boat dealer. In stock or custom order Tidewater starting at 18 feet and Sylvan pontoons up to 27 feet. Service, maintenance, and trailers. Find it all here at Racetrack Marine. We buy, broker, and sell pre-owned boats too. Deep discounts and the best stem to stern warranty available. Say goodbye to last year's boat repairs. Stop dreaming and start boating today. Racetrack Marine, the place that does it all. Sometimes, all you have to do is read the signs. Miller Lite has more taste, fewer calories, and half the carbs of Bud Light. What are you holding? Miller Lite, hold true. Hi, it's Marjorie and Stephen Fun. We're the Fun family. People often ask, where do the funds go to have fun? Ocean City, Maryland! Ocean City's middle name is Fun. Ironic because our last name is Fun. Is that Fun? <laughs> if you're looking for family fun, Take it from the Fun Family. Book a week in Ocean City, Maryland. Go to OCOcean.com and don't miss free events like beach fireworks. And now back for more Hooked on OC. It's this now you can say Big Bird Cropper looks up to me. Yeah. That's where it was. Yep, right there. And the high tide? Anytime. I mean, as long as the water was moving and the other where the big hump is. That was a real, that's how I found that log. I drifted up on it. It's, it's just under the water most of the time. It only comes up like once. There it is. They're gonna have to get rid of that. Huh. It's been down there a while, too. Yeah. That's a major. I think it's that's a major piece of piling. Yeah. But the tide is going out. They drew first blood, not me. They drew first blood. <laughs> little guy, little guy. Don't want him taking off and feeling froggy here at the end. Oh, look at that, buddy. It's a football. Look at that. Man, that's beautiful. Beautiful stuff, bird. Uh, look, man, you got to know who to go with. When the tog fishing wasn't going to pan out for me because of the crowd and I couldn't get the right bait. I called my man. I said, hey, Bird, what are you doing this afternoon? I got a show we got to finish up. Boom! Second cast! To tell you what! Beautiful Ocean City rockfish here. Folks, we'll talk about this in a minute, but there are some changes coming to the rock fishing regs next year. Um, they already stink, but they're going to stink even worse. But beautiful fish. Let me see it. Hold them up. Yep. Let me see Liza. Man, I'll tell you what, this, this rod does a great job. Just look at the bend in it, it's awesome. Nice, nice. Yeah, buddy! <laughs> yeah! All right, let's talk size limits for a second. Not even close, right, Bird? Not even close. Oh, uh. We are kind of in the unfortunate circumstances being on the coast. Oh, there's sea lights, Bird. 
See that? Oh, there you go. Check that out, folks. Bird was asking about sea lice a little while ago. You can tell that fish is fresh in from the ocean. He's got a sea lice on his back fin right there on that back dorsal fin. That means he came in, just came in from the ocean in this cool water. Water temperatures range around 50 degrees plus or minus. And these fish are lively, man. This is, this is Maryland State fish. Beautiful specimen here. Delicious to eat. We need them to be 28 inches down here. 28 to 38 is a slot we're allowed to keep them. Then we're allowed to keep another fish 44 or greater. So we're allowed two total in either one of those size ranges. That's all changing. Rockfish are now in trouble. So next year we're looking at a 28 to 38 inch slot. One fish, that's it. That's probably the alternative that's gonna end up happening. But at least they'll still be available to us. And a couple of years down the road, if we're careful about it, they'll be here in good numbers like they are right now. Boom! Yeah, buddy! Love fishing with Big Bird. Hooked on OC, we'll be right back. One of the shore's best kept secrets is a secret no more. Ocean Pines Golf and Country Club is home to the only Robert Trent Jones Sr. Championship Golf Course on the Eastern Shore. Ocean Pines is set amongst natural wetlands and scenic woodlands, making it a must play. Experience golf as it was meant to be played. Call 410 641 6057 or visit us online at oceanpinesgolf.org to book your tea time today. When it comes to offshore fishing equipment, Okaya means value. Like the 80 offshore combo for 730 and the 50 offshore combo for 530. Call Sophia at 443-880-2222 or check them out at okaya.com. Are you looking for the best crabs on this side of the Chesapeake Bay? Then head on over to Crabs to Go on the corner of Route 50 and 589. For over 20 years, Crabs to Go has been bringing you the fattest, tastiest crabs on the eastern shore available by the bushel or by the dozen. We also offer a full menu including shrimp, clams, oysters, scallops, lobster tails, crab meat, and soft crabs. Call ahead for fast, hot carryout. Or stop by for our homemade crab cakes, soups, and salads. This is where the locals come. Crabs to Go, Routes 50 and 589, West Ocean City. And now back for more Hooked on OC. Hi, my name is Jim Motzko. I'm president of the White Marlin Open and I'd like to take the time to personally invite each and every one of you to join us uh, August the 3rd through the 7th next year, 2020, for the 47th annual White Marlin Open. Uh, we're gonna have a hard time trying to top uh, that tournament with what we just completed. We had probably one of the most exciting tournaments uh, recently in August that will, will be remembered for a long period of time. Uh, number one, we have 404 boats registered to enter. Last year we had some unusual payouts uh, for the winners. It was the first time we had two people that won more than 1.5 million, the top two boats in White Marlin weight did that, but we also had uh, the Blue Marlin came close to winning a million dollars. They won over 900,000, and the Tuna Fish came real close to topping the million dollar mark, and that which won over 900,000 again. But some of the uh, really neat little things are the Mako that weighed 230 pounds, plus or minus, that was one of the biggest sharks we've had in a long time. And they won a good pile of money for that. 
And uh, last but not least, in the small boat division, we had a dolphin that was worth $74,000. So we had some, some heavy pay, payroll, and we had uh, a lot of different type winners. Uh, we had a winner come back from about nine years ago, Tom Hinkle fishing on the fish whistle, and they, they caught the heaviest white marlin this year. They also did it years ago. Also, uh, the second boat that won over a million and a half was also uh, not a stranger to our scale. They won the heaviest marlin a couple years ago when Cheryl McCleskey was fishing on the backlash. So that's two unique things that have happened. Our catch rate was way up there. We had over 1,459 billfish caught, 98% were released, and uh, our small boat division keeps building and building and building. In fact, the uh, fish whistle, it's only 38 feet, they also won the small boat heavy marlin award. So they cleaned up real well with, with their fish. But most importantly, we had good weather, we had some famous people in town. Michael Jordan was one. Emeril Legace was the other, who was a chef. And, uh, you know, hopefully they come back again next year. We're getting kind of an international flavor to our tournament, and people from literally all over the world are fishing it. That's why we like to have you join us again for those dates. We'll mark them down again, August the 3rd through the 7th, 2020. We have many boats that like to take advantage of our early entry discount. Uh, you can enter, uh, we actually have a boat entered right now for 2020 already. You save about $350 by doing it. And if you enter by June the 1st, you can take advantage of that. You can still finish up your registration and added entries right on site uh, the week of the tournament, the week before the tournament, I should say. And also you can do it online. So just because you enter early, we lock you in. That's the basic entry fee. And uh, you're saving some money that way. We have had some tremendous sponsors the last couple of years. And our list of sponsors keep growing. And we would love to have you uh, be a sponsor if you're not an angler or both. What the heck? Um, we have a big jumbo Tron screen that we show during the tournament so people on site can see it, but most importantly, people literally all over the world can see it by our live broadcast. I think last year we hit over 350,000 people uh, that were exposed to it, and um, that was from like 75 different countries. So we are a global event. It seems like no matter where people go, they've heard about the White Marlin Open, and uh, we had 404 boats, as I mentioned before. And we hope next year to just improve upon that, maybe five or 6%. Boats from all areas can actually fish the tournament from their home ports if they want to. However, you have to weigh your fish at our scale in Ocean City. We allow boats to leave from as far north as Barnegat Inlet in New Jersey, down to Atlantic City, Ocean City, New Jersey, Cape May, Stone Harbor, uh, Ocean City, Maryland, Shinkatig, Wachapreg if the inlet's open down there, Cape Charles, and Virginia Beach. So a lot of the boats have found it's a little bit difficult to get a big slip, big meaning 60 foot and up in Ocean City during the tournament. And uh, we're getting more and more boats every year fish from the various ports. And, and once again, as usual, we always try to add another ent added entry level for for boats that are, are looking for a little bit more to get into. Last year was our first year that we had, and it's not an added entry, we have a special award for the top three female anglers in release points. Uh, we also have a new added entry coming up in 2020. It's going to be on the board score. In other words, if you're on the scale each day and nobody bumps you out, you keep winning some money daily in addition to what you already won. And it's been popular in a couple other tournaments and we decide to do it. Uh, the boats keep wanting more to get into and we're happy to oblige them. 
I think that one of the main reasons that the White Marlin Open is so popular is it's not being held on an island in the middle of nowhere. It's an island called Ocean City, and we have major cities within a three-hour drive, Baltimore, Washington, Philadelphia. New York's only five hours from here. But Ocean City is a family resort. It's not like it's a... Um, like you're in a compound somewhere in a foreign country. You have probably the best beach on the East Coast right here. There's tons of restaurants, tons of things to do for non-fishermen. We have malls. We have all kind of fantastic restaurants in Ocean City and West Ocean City. And uh, it's just an overall easy place to get to. All members of the family can do different things. If the husband's out fishing with his son during the tournament and the girls don't want to go, they can go to the beach. They can go to the boardwalk. And it's, uh, it's a family place and that is tremendous for families to come down and enjoy the White Marlin Open experience. All the weigh-ins will be at Harbor Island Marina again, which is at 14th Street in Ocean City. You can take the bus there, which is really nice. Parking is limited. So uh, use the public transportation. The city is supplying buses right from the convention center to Harbor Island all during the tournament week. And we're grateful for the town of Ocean City for their help on this. One last time, I'd like to ask you one more time to consider coming down to Ocean City and fish the White Marlin Open. If you get lucky and your number's drawn, you're going to be a winner. Good luck. Hooked on OC, we'll be right back. Whether it's a chart plot or fish finder combo for your inshore bay boat, or a complete electronics package including radar, plotter, thermal imaging camera, autopilot or sonar, East Coast Marine Electronics can handle it all. Veteran owned and operated, give Chad a call at 443-880-7206 or email at chad at eastcoastmarineelectronics.com. Termites can strike without warning, coming up and damaging support structures of your home undetected for years. That's why it's vital to have termite protection you can trust. At Bennett Termite and Pest Solutions, besides our great service, we also stand behind our termite defense programs, from a chemical treatment to our termite bait station system. Help Bennett Termite and Pest Solutions make Delmarva termite free again. Remember Delmarva, quality isn't expensive, it's priceless. And now back for more Hooked on OC. Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to the show. We've reached that time in the show where we are going to bring you the angler's advantage. Every single show, we are here at Atlantic Tackle or Sunset Provisions or Sunset Marina or the Ocean City Fishing Center bringing you all things going on and happening up to date. We love to bring you things from here at Atlantic Tackle to tell you how to get your reels straight, where to buy the rods, where to get the rigs, where to get the bait, and that sort of thing. Off season, I have zero clue what any of this stuff does. All right, there's some pen something. There's some 656. Here's some, uh, here's some T9 rust and corrosion inhibitor. There's something called precision real oil. I don't have to have a clue though. Guess why? Because Dr. Dennis does. You have a small spinning reel you need fixed, need line on it, he's the guy to give it to. Need something like this? Ugh. Here's somebody's stuff ready to go right now. 
80 VSW, 130, you got something out there that needs repairs, needs just maintenance on it, oil, grease, that sort of thing to get ready for next season, Dr. D is the place to do it. And you don't want to wait too long, all right? He's going to get crowded. It's going to take a little while sometimes, but if you get in here right now, he's going to have plenty of time to get you done. Come in, fill out one of these tags. There it is. Repair tag, 410-213-0421. Upstairs, right around the corner. Come see Dr. Dennis, and he'll get you straight. Let's also talk about this. The JPR rod, hooked on OC style, is ready to go here at Atlantic Tackle. 259, we've got the casting version and the spinning version. What's up, guys? What's How are you? I didn't want to interrupt. You're good. Sp spinning is six feet long, all right? Nice action on it. And the casting, you know I've got this in my arsenal. Black, silver, and white in the Hooked on OC custom colors. And the curly Q. Get a shot up that rod, Dave. Look at that, people ask me all the time, what is going on with that thing? alleviates the line from hitting the blank as you get further up the rod and it's always inside an eye to give it a great bend. This is a terrific flounder rod. I use mine all the time in the back bay. You can even use it for small sea bass, togs, stripers, and that sort of thing. Right here at Atlantic Tackle every day downstairs, ask them for the hooked on OC rod. They're gonna point you right in the right direction. $259.99, gets it out the door. Great holiday gift. Not gonna fit in somebody's stocking, but it will fit under the tree. All right, we'll be back in just a second to finish out this episode of Hooked on OC. We'll see you in just a minute. Hooked on OC, we'll be right back. Sunset Provisions is Delmarva's largest marine supply retailer, stocking an unmatched selection of pumps, paints, hoses, cosmetic care products, and marine hardware. Featuring the absolute best brands in the industry, combine this unbelievable in-stock selection of top name brands with super competitive pricing and a seasoned staff that can help you navigate your project. Make Sunset Provisions Delmarva's go-to marine supply store. So stop by or call today and see for yourself what makes Sunset Provisions the area's best marine supply store. Sunset Provisions is located in West Ocean City at Sunset Marina. Sometimes, all you have to do is read the signs. Miller Lite has more taste, fewer calories, and half the carbs of Bud Light. What are you holding? Miller Lite. Hold true. Spencer Yachts Brokerage presents the 44-foot Spencer Express Traveler, the 47-foot James Hudson Gala Mine, the 48-foot Custom Carolina Oceans East, the 57-foot Ricky Scarborough Sally Girl, the 70-foot Spencer Plain Simple. The 74-foot Spencer Centurion. The 87-foot Spencer Bangarang. All available at SpencerYB.com. Now back for more Hooked on OC. Five foot, stays five foot all the way through this little cove here. Just on the spot. Something here. Have you ever slept under the bridge? I figured you had. No, I don't. Oh! I can't get in there. <laughs> I knew I felt the bite. Yeah. Let's do some species talk. Yeah, look at this, dude. Right on. Striped bass on the Roy rig. You guys have heard it said before. The man, the myth, the legend here, he invented it. Three quarter or so ounce lead head, sassy shad body. This man hand sharpens the hooks and all of that. Bird, where you got them now? Bahia. Oh, a lot of all Be time. Bahia. Okay, Bahia, Raceway, Sitka, those are the places you can get them. Also, if you don't live in the area, they're on my Fishing OC website. You can pick them up there if you'd like. Big Bird's world famous Roy Rig, doing the ticket. And there he is, these little schoolie striped bass. 
If you read the fishing report, you read any fishing report, and somebody refers to a schooly sized striped bass, this is what they're talking about. Fish in the 15 to maybe 20, 24 inch range. They're in these larger schools, 12, 15, 50 fish all hanging out together in the same spots. I just cast it up in there in one spot. Bam, I got a hit, threw it in there on the very next cast and caught this little dude. You can see his downturned mouth, right? That's for foraging along the bottom. Very aggressive, very fast fish. He can swim around down there, no problem, speeding through these pilings. They eat crabs, they eat shrimp, they eat small fish like minnows, they eat small fish like bunker, mullet, spot, they love all of that stuff. I saw a straight bass last year that was barely legal size, 29 and a half or so inches. It had 14 flounder in its belly. What? Look at that, Maryland state fish, beautiful specimen. You can see the difference between a natural striped bass and a, uh, what do they call them, bird? Hybrid. hybrid striped bass because of the stripes on his side here. Really nice, clean, even green stripes, hybrid striped bass. There are a lot of times they're broken up going down the side of the fish. I'm gonna get this bad boy back in the water. Yeah! Bird. <laughs> <laughs> Driving the boat too. Oh yeah. Yeah, buddy. Can I say it? Can I say it? Get outdoors, Del Marvel. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, it's got me hooked on us. Don't apologize. Nice fish, man. He's full, dude. See him? He was probably eating those. Oh, yeah. Come on, brother. This is a little stouter fish, man. We need a big one to be a keeper. This is a little bit stouter than the last one. Look at that bird. It's a quality fish, man. Yeah, buddy. Let's do that, Roy. Let's do it. Good there. There it is, man. Another quality rockfish. This one was pulling a little bit harder than those last couple. He's only two or three inches longer, but he had a little little butt behind him. Um, and he ate it out away from the bridge. You never know. You always got to keep your retrieve nice and slow or fast, depending on which way the fish are eating. We found it to be a nice slow retrieve, kind of keeping it close to the bottom. No real twitching involved, just a kind of a nice steady pullback. The Roy rig does the rest. And that's another beautiful rockfish. He ate it out here, almost coming out of the shadow, just about 25 feet or so away from the boat. But beautiful, beautiful straight bass. Man, we are working hard to get a smaller fish here in Ocean City and along the coast. Don't think it's gonna happen for a couple of years, if at all, but it would really be nice if it was. And, I'll show you what we're doing this on, man. Bird, tell us about the world famous Roy Rig. There it is. You came up with this how many years ago? Oh, probably 20. I was working heavy equipment out on the highways, and I didn't even have a boat. We were all shore fishermen. And before all the millionaire houses got put up over on Stinky Beach, we used to fish out there. Yep. It's funny, in the summertime, people will go, hey, Roy, well, my name ain't yeah, Roy, no, right. you know? <laughs> That's right. Um, I named it after a gentleman that came back from Florida, and that was a freshwater tail at one time. Yep. And yep. he brought it back, and we're like, wow, I flipped out on it. And I burnt the hairs off a bucktail that day. And it was working good, but it weren't swimming right for me. So after uh, I, every one ounce hook that I found always had a real long hook in it. Mm -hmm. And I'm like, you need to shorten up the hook. So I gotcha. shortened up the hook. So rather than coming way back here, yeah. you shorten it up to where it comes up in the middle With, of the body before this first dorsal. When you wiggle it, you'll see the tail moving oh, yeah. like, yeah. yeah. So that makes the difference right there. It's a short shank hook with just under a one ounce head. And there it is, man. My own. My sister used to get madder and fire at me because I'd go over and swim in her swimming pool because I wanted to see, I mean, all <laughs> sort, sorts of different weights. And I mean, I was a diver. I could sit on the bottom and have my daughter jig it by me, you see know. How it looks. And I wanted to see how yeah. it looks. And we started playing. I've got every one. I've even 
slit the belly of it open and put the weight up inside it with a hook coming at it. It just didn't work. Gotcha. I'm always, I got one rigged up here different. That I'm this always, is the winning combination. That's, it, it works. And it's and the, where the eye is on the head makes a difference. Yep. Where the hook falls on the body makes a difference. So birds cut out all that work for you. It's yep. right here, ready to go. It is an absolute rockfish slayer here in Ocean City. I've sent them to as far north as New Jersey and New York through the website. And they're a really, really great rig. He hand sharpens every single hook. This is really sturdy. It's not going to go anywhere. And it's, this is not a joke when I say that he and neighbor Dave and other friends sit in his living room and watch Jerry Springer and put Roy rig packs together. That is not a joke. That is not a Jerry, stretch. Jerry, <laughs> Jerry, Jerry. Hey, yeah. hey, whatever. You're my, yeah, my, 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 my girlfriend. Yeah, okay. <laughs> But he has an absolute blast putting these together. Yeah. Support a local business. He's not trying to make a ton of money on these. He just <laughs> likes putting a good product in front of people, and this is definitely that. You can find it at a bunch of tackle shops around town. Like I said a little while ago, you can get it on the Fishing OC website on, on our shop. We sell them and ship them around the country. And people love them all over the place because the species list is extensive for this thing. It's not just a rockfish lure. Bluefish, flounder, red drum, speckled trout, tarpon. gray trout, tarpon. Um, oh, hell, up there in Ohio. Bluefish. Blue, oh, man, they're a little bluefish. Killer, bluefish killer. Yeah, I mean, I, I ship them there in Ohio. I yep. ship them to Keys. I got one, like I said, the picture I've got with the, um, the tarpon. The tarpon. Yeah. Oh, man, with a rig hanging right there. Pretty like awesome. That. Yeah, yeah. Pretty awesome. But it's an absolutely awesome rig, especially for fishing this bridge, the South Jetty, the North Jetty, and even the pier that sticks out in the ocean. Big Bird's world famous Roy rig. Fishing with the man himself. He got the novel.
Hooked on OC. We'll be right back. Red Sun Custom Apparel opened for business in Ocean City, Maryland with the mission of providing total customer satisfaction. Our philosophy is simple. Offer a wide selection of leading products at competitive prices and provide high quality customer service seven days a week. Our customers place orders with confidence knowing they will be completed on time and accurate according to the high standards Red Sun Custom has quickly become known for. Call us today for all of your promotional needs. And now back for more Hooked on OC. All right, Bird. There we go. Did the ticket again, man. Another you look at even broke it a little bit. Another successful trip. Another with successful the Roy. trip, man. Some beautiful rockfish. Thank you again, brother. Hey, man. Always appreciate Anytime you taking you us out. There's more trips to come with you in 2020 as well. Had a great trip. A couple trips there at the Route 50 Bridge, man. Wintertime fishing here. A lot of people don't know how good it is. Striped bass are around pretty much all year round. We've got some changes coming to those. Striped bass regulations are not going to be the same in 2020 as they are right now. And they're already kind of sucky. So um, more on that later. But thanks to David Wells. Nice congratulations on catching your first ever speckled trout. Dale Timmons, thank you for coming along. Sorry that red drum just quite didn't make it. And Big Bird, thank you as always, hey, brother. brother. Had a great time. Folks, we're looking to an awesome 2020 season. Party boat fishing this winter is going to be good. Tall tog and sea bass and all that sort of thing. we got another trip planned to, uh, planned to Costa Rica in 2020 as well. In March, we'll be going there and showing you some stuff from Costa Rica. Having a great time. And you never know where else we might be coming from. But we will bring it to you here every Sunday morning at 7 a.m. We appreciate you watching. Thanks so much. Check out the website, www.hookedonoc.com, for all of our past episodes of the show. See you next time.